All right, folks. So what we've done here is we've replaced the shift solenoids on a Transit Connect of 2012. And uh, I wasn't able to show you the actual work being done because, well, I'm, I'm dumb and forgot to video it. But uh, anyway, so these are A and B uh, shift solenoids. And if you have one go bad, well, it's one of these. And uh, you just simply, t t these are the new ones. They've already been installed. These are the old ones. Look exactly the same as the new ones, of course. These are the old ones. And so all you've got to do is there's a bolt here. Right where my finger is, is undo that bolt. This one for, this one's right here. Undo it. Simply take your uh, push in on this uh, piece of plastic here and that'll unlock it and you just simply pull it out and then this thing will come out and uh, undo the bolt pull the solenoid out you can do this when the solenoid is attached or it's off it won't matter but uh, you just push it in folks push it in then pull it out uh, both are the same and that's basically it to replace these. Now, once you, I mean, if you're going to replace these, you might as well replace the filter. And so you've got the little sensor deal here. And you just simply pull that out, pull that, and that whole thing will come out like so. I don't, I don't want to take it off, but uh, take the little sensor off and just simply pull the filter off. It, nothing to unscrew. It just simply pulls right off and of course when you go to put it back on you just push it in the hole and um, it goes right back on pretty pretty simple now several several uh, bolts to take off and you see how clean we've got this we've sanded this with sandpaper a very fine sandpaper and and we've got it super clean that's what you want to do and uh, I do believe that's it folks let's uh Let's look at the filter, and, and you'll see on this old filter that there is, right here there's a, there's a hole, and you just simply push that filter, which has a thing on it with a gasket around it, in that hole, and it attaches and holds it. Something grabs over here as well and uh, holds it, but you'll see it's just kind of like a snap-in type thing, but that's it. So shift solenoids and uh, if you're having trouble with your uh, transmission uh, check that uh, shift solenoid out first you know YouTube it easy to easy to figure out if it's the shift solenoid or not now this is my son's van and he took it by AutoZone or wherever and they actually put it on the computer and said yes yeah, the shift solenoid um, and so well we replaced it and that's it so we're gonna put the uh gasket on the pan put the pan back and fill her up with transmission fluid and that'll be it but that's it shift solenoid so one more time push this in pull it out snaps right back in Unscrew the bolt, wiggle and jiggle, and it'll come out. Same exact with this one over here. Simply take, to get the filter off, take this off here. It's very simple. And just pull it out. Pull it out. Nothing to unscrew. But remember on these, I've seen a couple of videos where the guys are trying to pull these out. And they didn't pull the bolts out here that hold them in place. So... That's it, folks. So we're going to fill her up and see if we did it right. And, uh, well, you know we did. So the the pan, with a pan, hang on, folks. So the pan, we uh, we did the same way.